guys, welcome back to another video with Pancake and Tia. And today we're going to be showcasing and using and kind of testing yeah. uh, this parabolic reflector, which will is supposed to increase Wi-Fi signal strength. So uh, this is the router, and it's not connected to the internet, but you can detect the signal strength of it with an app on like your phone. And it's called 06B4031. It's that one right there. And right now it's at negative 15 decibel milliwatts, which is, a, which is good. That is, that is strong for Wi-Fi, probably because we're right next to it. But we're gonna test the signal strength on here of this 10 meters away. All the way over there. That's where we have stuff set up. I think it's through my tripod. And um, we're gonna change the angle of the of the um, parabolic reflector to see how it affects the signal strength. So can you tell us how it's made? Yeah. So the way we made the parabolic reflector is we had is you you can just take like some thin sort of sh cardstock or something that you can bend and then you put your like, the aluminum foil on which reflects Wi-Fi pretty good or a lot of signals and that and you also want some thick per perforated cardboard or not perforated uh, or the like you know this kind of cardboard just regular cardboard yeah and you want to cut it up and you want to put spacers in between that so if you can kind of see in there there's there's two levels of spacers. See, two. There, it's like four. It's a sandwich, and so that makes it thick. And then you want a hole through the middle, right at the focal point. And we can have uh, like the there's like a, a parabola like template. So we could put that in in the description. And then. You want to use like string or something and poke through the holes on here, on this aluminum foil thing. And then you want to make it so that it fits the um, form and then sort of just tape the form in. So, yeah. Do you want to get testing? Sure. We are recording audio over here and video over at the parabolic reflector. And so, and we're going to be taking screenshots of the screen so you can see what it looks like. So, right now we're at um, zero degrees. Let's take one every 10 seconds. One. What degree should we do next? Okay, so we're gonna do 90 degrees. So, as you can see, it's at 90 degrees. And one. Was that three screenshots? Yeah. Okay, now uh, do 45. Okay, now we're at 45 degrees. Are we gonna do 180? Uh, we gotta do 135 degrees. Which is 45 degrees. More behind than 90, so. Okay, I think that was, yeah, that was fine. Okay, and then now 180. facing the opposite direction and for some reason it's right now it's reading at negative 55 decibel milliwatts but it's going down which is good and now we're going to do it without the parabolic reflector so now it has no more parabolic reflector so the signal strength is better 
than when it had it facing 180. So. Okay, that seems good. Yeah. So now we will record our results and write down our findings. Okay, guys. So we're back, and do we have the results here from the testing? Um, so, you probably cannot read my terrible writing, but these are the degrees, 0, 45, 90, 135, 180, and just without a parabolic reflector, and then these are the three trials, and then this is the average. So, you can look at all these numbers, pause the video if you feel, just saying, this one here, these question marks, is because we didn't have data, that was the time that for some reason it disappeared. So we just averaged those two numbers. But here are the averages. So pause the video if you feel like it. And or and there's a picture in the description that you can check out if you want to see the data. Okay, so here are the averages. Sarah, do you want to read out the averages? Okay, so for it pointing straight at us is a, an average of negative 44 and one third for um, 45 degrees, it's negative 57. For uh, 90 degrees, it's negative 58 and one third. For 135 degrees, it's 61 and one third. Negative 61. Yeah, negative 61 and one third. For 180 degrees, it's negative 58 and one third. Same as 40, uh, same as 90 degrees. And for no parabolic uh, reflector, it is negative 48 and one third. Yeah, and so all of the these numbers here, except for the degrees, are in decibel milliwatt. There's like a link in the description if you want to learn about that. It's confusing. There's a long way to convert it into milliwatts. Um, but basically, uh, it's for Wi-Fi. It's usually in negative numbers, and and these look pretty promising because, uh, like obviously the the larger the number then the stronger the signal strength and so all you just look at if you just want to look at it simply you can just look at that the parabolic reflector pointed straight on which is how you would usually have it is negative 44 and one third which is a f which is pretty much which is a good amount better than no parabolic reflector so it looks pretty good mm -hmm. so yeah i guess that's all for today yeah so anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe. Subscribe. Turn on notifications. Share. And pancakes. And syrup. Uh, out. out.